Hello and welcome to Informatica's video KB. In this video we are going to have a look at enforcing the password policy for Informatica Cloud. I'm Madan and we will have a quick look at the options to enforce some authentication options with Informatica Cloud. Password policies can actually be an organizational requirement and also it's a best practice along with various security considerations. Most organizations have predefined policies in terms of how a password can be set for an enterprise application and Informatica gives you an excellent option set for enforcing password policies in Informatica Cloud. To access Informatica's password policy all you will have to do is go you will have to be logged on as an admin administrator first then go to administer and click on organizations and you will be able to access the authentication options under which the password policy options are available to you. Now below are some of the policy options that are available in Informatica Cloud along with the limitations that we provide. So you can set the minimum password length it can be anywhere between 1 to 6 you can have the minimum character mix so when we speak about character mix it could be the uppercase lowercase numerical kind of limitations that you could probably have and you can set the password reuse allowed option whether you want to allow it at all or do you want to kind of you know limit it to the total number of days in an increment of 30 days up to 180 days the same limitation applies for expiry of the password. You could either choose not to expire the password at all or you can set at an increment of 30 days up to 180 days. We also support two-factor authentication so what this means is you can predefine this range of IP addresses from which access should be allowed. Now we can actually see the screenshot of the authentication options. As I said you can go to administer organization to access the authentication option and the, the entire range of options are pretty much available on the drop down menus. Now you could for a reference refer the mix of characters that you could have as I mentioned earlier it could be lowercase alphabets, alphabets, uppercase alphabets, digits and special characters. Now this is a pretty powerful, it's simple, straightforward and more importantly pretty secure. It gives you complete or control as an administrator to be in compliance with their organizational requirements. Quick access to make changes is the most important key because you could log in anytime as an administrator and you can enforce and make changes to your policies with regards to passwords. And more importantly, it allows you an option to expire passwords so that you can avoid active logins which are otherwise dormant and unused so that that can actually be deactivated without having to manually de without you having to manually intervene. So I guess that that gives you an overview of the password policies that Informatica Cloud has to offer and uh, we would love to hear from you more. If you have any feedback you can reply to us over an email at supportvideos at informatica.com or you can follow us on Twitter on InfaSupport. Until we meet next time this is Madan. Thanks for watching this video.